How's it going, Dazzlers? Welcome back to Daz Games. We are back with another horror game. I've been told really good things about today's horror game. It's called Stalker, and it is exactly as the name uh, applies. You are being stalked by a crazy ex-partner. You start as this young woman who is trying to escape the clutches of an ex-boyfriend and decides to take refuge in your grandparents' house. And then everything goes nuts. I'm so excited to play this. It sounds so intense. And it sounds like it's got a good story. Let's play the game. All right. This is the stalked. This is us. Very beautiful lady. And this is probably our stalker, I'm guessing. All right, let's get creepy. Oh. I had to break up with Liam, and I hope he takes it well. Ah, most men don't. Oh, okay. I mean, I wouldn't take it well. Clearly, she's got money. Look at this. Got a hovering fireplace. I don't even have a hovering fireplace! I'm gonna close the door though, because, you know, we know what this theme of the game is. Wow! Wow. I need to make some food, I'm hungry. Yeah, you know, breakups. Breakups are hard, you know? But don't eat too much, because no one will want you! <laughs> Toxic! Wow, this TV. You don't need a boyfriend! You've got this TV! Look at that shit! Oh yeah, Netflix tonight on my own! Oh, should we just, just take some fresh air in? The single life. I'm a girl, living in the city. With no security. What could go wrong? What a beautiful night. You know what, I, I would leave that open, but again, I know the theme of the game. Oh, I'm getting in there later. Netflix and chip! Right, let's make some dinner in my marble paradise. No one needs a man when you've got this sort of kitchen. All right, what are we making? Ah, oh, it's cooking simulator all over again. Except this one doesn't blow up. Is it on? Do you put some oil in there? What am I making, eh? Yeah, yes, yes. What are, we, what are we cooking? Organic food. Perfect white girl food. Look at that. Is, is, if it was that easy. Where's the fridge? be knocking my door at this hour. It's Liam, you silly bitch. Don't leave that on. Take it off. It's like the beginning of Scream. I'm gonna burn my organic food. Liam! If that's you! Who's there? Oh, it is Liam. Hi, honey, can I come in? No! Uh, Liam, I told you it's over, so no, you can't come in. Come on, you can't just leave me like that. I love you more than anything. It's over, Liam. Just go home. Oh, shit, Liam. Open the door, Kate. No, I'm not opening the door. I don't love you anymore, Liam. I never did. You will be mine again soon. Oh, now it's time to it's time to stop cooking organic canned food and call the police. Sounds like he walked away. No, he's on the roof. Liam! Man, he climbed some stairs for me, though. That, that man is dedicated. Okay, just make sure you close everything. Why am I opening everything? Close it. Can I not lock shit? Let's go back and, like, see my burnt food. We're just carrying on with our evening, then. Like, that didn't happen. Oh. I guess it was a bit burnt. Bath to calm themselves down a bit. Don't get in the shower when your stalker's outside. You're asking for it now. And you've just... What is this wall? But I kind of dig that. I kind of dig it. There's the bar. For my rich girl. Look at that bar! What was that? I'm coming back. Don't worry. I'm gonna shower in that. Ha, oh, this is so... You're really pissing me off. I was really looking forward to that. Something broke. Oh. Oh, no. That's what you get for having a castle of glass. Give me another chance, please. I will treat you well and do anything you want. I promise. Just one chance is all I ask. 
That can't be too much, can it? I tell you what is too much, Liam. The bill to replace this window! Yeah, I should leave. I can't even lock this shit now. Where did he even get a rock from in the city? Shit. If that scratched my TV, I swear to <clears throat> ah! It's Tony fucking Hawk! Bane Liam, that's a skateboarder! I have to run? But where, where can I run? My pantry? Alright, so he's out there. Right, now, now listen, I need a place to run. Where can I run? Where Tony Hawk won't get me? My boyfriend's Tony Hawk. That's Tony Hawk. I, I'm sorry. <clears throat> oh, yeah, he, he just popped up. Get out. Get out. Is that it? Oh, shit. We made it to the car. Is he in the car? He's going to pop up in the back seat. Grandpa. Don't call your grandpa. What's he going to do? Have a stroke in front of him. Hello, Grandpa. I need your help. Hey, Kate. What's going on? Liam broke into my apartment and chased me. I barely got away. And now I'm in my car with nowhere to go. That's horrible. Are you okay? Did he hurt you or something? Hurt my window. No. Got away before he could do something. But I'm literally terrified he will find me. Can you transfer me a million dollars? Okay, I assume you're looking for a place to stay for a while. Yes, please! You can come live with me for as long as you need. However, I'm going to be out on a business trip for a week. Of course you are. That's fine. Still safer than being here. Can I get there right now? Yeah, I sent you the address. How do we not know his address? He's our grandpa. Also, remember to keep the doors locked. And if you need to go outside, you can always check the peephole first. Thanks, Grandpa. No problem. I hope all goes well. Don't hesitate. Call me again. First of all, why is Grandpa out on a business trip? Why is he not retired? Ah, Tony! Drive the fucking car! It's Tony Hawk, isn't it? I'm not mental. Alright, well, we're away. That was a close call. Thank God I made it out. Yeah, barely. Liam won't be able to find me anymore. He will. He will. He's going to skate to your house. I've finally broken free from that toxic relationship. He literally threw a rock, bro. You can't just go to your granddad's and hope your money will save you. You've got to call the police. Oh, yeah! Perfect! Let's go to the woods! Where no one will find me! Why does Grandpa live here? You want to check the flight logs to Epstein's Island? Because I'm ten. Oh no! Did he follow me here? Of course he did! I'm getting too paranoid now. Of course it's not him. It's probably just a neighbour who just randomly followed you. You know what? We deserve to get kidnapped. Oh, this house is huge, bro. Yeah, we're definitely living out of Grandpa's pocket. That's why we called him and not our dad. Just have to turn your flashlight on. Liam! You better not be pitching a tent out there. I mean, I, I would, because this is prime camping grounds. All right. Grandpa clearly has stocks. Keys under the flower pot. Can I crouch? There we go. Done it. Alright, Grandad. I see you. Wow, it's dark in here. Let's turn some lights on and find a bedroom. I want to hit the bed ASAP. How can you sleep? How can you sleep, woman? Oh, there's the peephole. Yeah, that'll work. Can we lock it, though? Can we... Oh. Yeah, we can lock doors. Finally, this is making sense. Ah, there we go. All right, can we go around and lock all of the doors, please? And turn every single light on. Because this, this man can afford the electricity. Damn. He's a member of some club. Jesus ain't going to help you. Can we cook more? Oh, well, great. 
Rich as fuck, not even a carrot in the fridge. Okay, let's get used to the layout of this place because I guarantee you he's going to get in here and we're going to have to run from him. Probably take something with me and pawn it in and go to Tahiti. Okay, downstairs bathroom. Great. Fantastic. Love it. Spacious. Oh no. Okay, so I can't... Oh, no. No, no, no. No, no, dear. No, you need to lock that. Okay. So, there are two exits down here. And they're both locked. So, he can't get in. There's no... Is there windows? Can I just... Why haven't I called the police? Why am I dumb? Oh, this house is too big for this kind of shit. If I hear one window break, that's it. Wait, can I... Let's turn that on. Oh, damn. Jesus Christ. What does my granddad do? Can I... No, I can't lock the interior doors. So that's not good. Okay, well... The house isn't that big when you look at it. Ah, there we go. He's sleeping on this Chesterfield. Okay. I mean, I, I found the bedroom. Yeah, that, that's it. This will make everything go away. He's going to be under my bed with his thumb out. Oh, it's daytime. Oh, I slept that long. Well, yeah. I've been running away. Well, this is daytime, though. That's a, diff that's a different thing. No, put your phone away. Is Grandpa home already? That ain't Grandpa. That ain't Grandpa! That's my car out there. Can I get a view on it? I don't think I can. Liam! I'll drop a grandfather clock on your ass! Yeah, look, there it is. Epstein's Island. I guarantee you my grandfather's a part of it. Look at this shit. Go look through the peephole. Hmm. I mean, do I really want to open it, though? That's the thing. There's no peephole here. I mean, it doesn't look to be anyone there. Right? I can't see anyone. Oh, shit. It's not my birthday either. Do you know of this mansion? I am previous owner of the mansion, and you are the person I've been looking for. I hope to see you stick around for a while. I'm sure we'll get along just fine. I will be watching you. This is a strange to say the least. Going to the store before it's dark, though. Let's be careful. Yeah, we do need to go to the store because, you know, there is nothing here. Locking the doors. That must be from Liam, surely. Dude, the hay fever living here. Imagine it. Oh, wait, the boot. Oh, okay. I entered via the boot. stock up that fridge because damn oh, we're actually shopping convenience store very convenient though considering the location ah the van the van whoever drove here in the van is stopping it what's that some kind of paper who's that is he taking money out or Oh, well, that's creepy how similar she looks to me. Oh, Ashley missing since. Please help bring Ashley home. If you have any information, even the smallest detail, contact the police. Your assistant can make all the difference. Huh. This is all right. I hope they found her. Well, th they haven't found her if it's on the floor. Oh, I got a shopping list. Canned food, snack, soda, milk, cereal, wine. Easy. Perfect white gal night in. Oh, oh hi there. I haven't seen you here before. Are you new? Go away! With your jazz hands. They just moved in. Where do you live? I don't feel comfortable telling you that. Good girl. Are you alone? What is the matter with you? Uh, I'm in a hurry, so i got to go. Why is everyone stalking me? Bro, you need to get more customer. Are you twins? 
Oh, he's got a neck ponytail thing. That's not a good look. It's not a good look. Mind, I should shut up because, you know, I've been stalked by everyone. Okay. So, canned food. Are you withdrawing from that or? I don't know. Okay, canned food. Oh, there it is. Yeah, we need some more of that organic food. Some snacks. Gotta get some snacks. What we got here? Chips. Original. Soda. Oh. Better not got in my car. You weird bitch. Okay, some sodas, of course. Yeah, night in. You know, we've had a stressful, stressful morning. You know? Where's the milk? Should be in the fridge, right? If it's not in the fridge, I'm going to freak out. It's not. Cereal. Okay. And, you know, and of course, some wine. You know, we need to unwind. Oh. Who's that? Why is his car driving on butter? Ooh. Uh, hello, is that all? Yes. Otherwise, I would have got more. All right, the total is 22. Do you know, that's not bad. Thank you for shopping here. Also, I can tell you are new in the area. How long are you staying for? No problem. I'm not sure yet. Not too long, I would assume. What's that? I thought a KKK member jumped up. It's my shopping. All right, have a good day. Here's your groceries. Thank you. Why does everyone here look like they nonce? Should I draw some cash out? No. Well, then that's clearly Liam, isn't it? Liam. I will. <laughs> no. A young people need like you should be alone like this. What's wrong with this neighbourhood? What do you want? I do have some wishes, but I think it's best they remain unspoken. Be careful and don't let me catch you all alone again. I don't need your warnings. Respect my space and stay away. Are they breeding them here? What's wrong with the men? Do you know what this game should be called? It should be called American Woman Simulator. <laughs> Someone's texting me. It's probably Liam. Oh, great. Let's not forget the groceries in the car. Yeah, don't forget that. Doesn't matter. You're going to have a thumb in your ass unwillingly. Get inside. I wonder if I left it unlocked, if that would like actually change the course of the game. That would be quite cool. Ah! Home sweet home! Let's put this in the fridge, because, you know. Or not, that's fine. Where, where do I put the... Store the groceries in the fridge? There you go. Oh, look at that! Look at that! I'm just living my life. England has fuck me. Welcome home. Oh, who is it? I mean, we, we look beautiful in the store today. It's a creepy guy. I bet you the plot twist. It was the cashier. Can't wait to see you again. How'd you get my number? Lock the door. Getting closer. What? Is he upstairs? Oh my God, I'm actually shitting it. Find the door. Shit. Damn it! Oh, I don't want to go upstairs now. Why did I come here? Why is every man here? Oh my god. See him. I ain't going upstairs. There ain't no way. No, I'm not checking the door. I've just checked it. I'm not opening it because I'm not a moron. There's no one there. No, I'm not checking the door. Let me check upstairs. And I don't know. I know most men are creepy, but not all every man in the town is this stalky. It's a tad unrealistic. I must be stunning. I right, check the door. It's asking me to check the door. Even though I've checked the door and I've looked out of it, look, there's no one there. It's asking me to open the door. Fuck. Oh, God. Settling in, you 
you may believe this mansion is your refuge, but every step you take reveals a deeper game. And with you in every choice, every move, there's no escape from being mine. This is getting out of hand. I need to drive away and call the police before it's too late. Get in the car. Get in the car. Get in the car. No, not now. Oh, no! Check the spark plug. We're going to die. We're going to die. I'm going to be someone's coat. You've left the door open. Oh, no! Call the police. Press F to call the police. Shit. No, stand by the front door. Because if he comes in... It's your emergency. Everything! I need help. I've been... Receiving letters. Yep. I'm here to help you. Can you please provide your... Oh, God, I'm so scared! I'm at blah, 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 blah. It's urgent. I understand. I'm dispatching officers to your location right away. Can you describe the nature of the threats? A really cringy prick! You're watching me, following me. The messages I'm getting are intense. Please hurry. Stay on the line with me. Help is on the way. In the meantime, try to find a secure location in your home. And make sure you lock the doors. Bathroom. Because I may need to shit. Shit. Oh! I'm here until the officers arrive. Someone just tried to open the door. Officers will be there any second now. Can I... Can I close the door? Shit. Here they come! Fuck me, that was quick! Definitely paying my council tax. Are they here? Are they here? Is that your residence? Oh, really? We're bringing him in for questioning. If something else happens, don't hesitate to call us. Take care. Thank you! White van. So it was the guy from the store. Phew, what a relief. Never thought I'd feel safe again, but maybe things go back to normal now. Every man you've encountered is stalking you. That's just one of them. Let's head to the basement outside and restore the power. Why is the basement outside? What home is this? Oh, God. All this money in the basement's outside. It's probably around the back, isn't it? Oh, no, that's the side door. Did I lock the door? I don't think I did. You know, at this point, who gives a shit? Oh, wow. And this is open? Need to invest in security. Lock burner. Oof. I'm sweating now. What's that? Power should be back on now. Yay. Ah, oh, man, I'm honestly. Run, run, run. Oh God, who would live here? I stink of sweat, let's take a bath. Finally! Ah. Oh. Lock, lock the doors. Oh, I've been dying to use this bath. You seen the size of this bath? Ugly fat men have been stopping me from using it. Where is it? Where is it? Have I lost my mind? Where, where's the bath? Yeah. Damn it. Now I'm in a towel. I'm vulnerable. My ass is out. Ah. Oh. Finally, a moment of peace. Really? You could just relax. That stranger goes so far for me. Whatever, it's over now. All right, Miss Oblivious. Surprised he's not in the bath with me. Hmm? What? 
so exhausted. I'm hearing things now. Let's just go to bed. Oh, shit. I'm actually, I'm actually feeling quite stressed from this. Oh, shit. Right, both doors are locked, right? Because he hasn't been able to get in. Okay, let's just go to bed. Just all this land outside the house. It would be great if I could lock this door as well. Okay. Get to bed, all nice and cozy. Nothing's gonna suck my toe. Town is after me, you know. Where was the storage room? That's the bathroom. Shit, I didn't realize there was a room there. I want to unlock the door just in case I haven't got. Ah! <sighs> Honestly, fucking Elvis got me now. I should probably call to check on how Liam is doing. I mean, the reason all this is happening to begin with is because I broke up with him. It's all my fault. If I just stayed with Liam, they would have kept it safe. Are you joking? No. No, of course not. What am I thinking? Let's put my mind on something else. But first, let's make sure the house is empty. I still don't feel safe. I'm fucking calling Leah. Oh, what's wrong with the chair? Was that like that before? I should check the storage room. I didn't know this room was here. Shit. What? Something looks off about that book. God. Epstein, I'm telling you, my granddad's involved! What? I told you, no rich old man has a house like this without noncing! Sudden disappearance of Ashley's whereabouts unknown. She's in the house. Look, honey, we made the news pretty cool, right? What? I can't replace you, Ashley. There is no one. Why did you force me to do this? I never wanted to harm you. My- Ah! Ah! She has to be my girl. What is my- God damn it! Fucking heads in a box! Why would you want me to leave? This, this is my grandfather's house. Grandpa, but what's going? Don't talk to Grandpa. I'm telling you, he's on an island somewhere, thumbing something. Oh shit! Grandpa, are you there? Yeah. So something happened. Yeah, there's a girl's head in a box. What's happening? I've received creepy letters and been followed by someone. I don't think it's Liam. I called the police and they arrested a suspicion of lurking around the house. But when I thought it was all over, I found a strange hidden room in your house that contains. Psychotic things to say the least. What? This is the same. Maybe the police arrest the guy leaving the letters and the hidden room. I've lived for 10 years and I've never seen that. Must be cutting his business short ASAP and. Oh no, he's coming home! I'd like to think they arrested him, but what if they didn't? What if he's still out there? What if they arrested someone who got set up? It's making me so uneasy just thinking about it. What do you remember about the person who brought this place? They definitely be the case. I remember. His wife had recently gone missing without a trace. It was the talk of the town for quite a while. And his name was... Oh. Oh. If I ran out of battery and I 
didn't have time to bring my charger with me. Yo! Let's go find a flashlight in case I need it on later. I think I remember seeing one in the basement. Ah, damn it! It's locked. Of course it is, because there's a bitch down there. Oh my god. How, how, do, how do you not know? These books would have to be placed on there. Your grandfather is doing this. Man, what a twist. And now i got to go outside. Wait. Check this first. I can't check it anymore. Why? Shit. Jesus Christ. Ah! No, stop calling me. It's probably Liam. Flashlight down here. Okay. I'll just run. Whatever you see. Run away! Run away, you fuck bird bastard! Beat bastard! Ah! Ha! Oh god, I'm so on edge! Lock the door. I should search for a weapon. Now we're talking! Grandpa's office. Get a gun. Shoot anything that comes in. Even if it's your grandpa. I'm shooting him. I'm shooting him. I don't believe that shit for a second. Got another hidden bookcase? Somewhere? Huh? There's got to be like a ha. Uh -huh. Chips. Huh, we eat the same kind of chips. What's that? in here. Where now? Shit. Has to be Grandpa, right? Was his business trip in a tree down the road? That was too quick. Oh my god. Nah, if it was Grandpa... <laughs> Sorry if I scared you. I just had to come... Clean about something. What? Of course, you're right. The creep talked to me earlier outside the convenience store. What do you want to come clean about? I know it was creepy, but it wasn't my idea. Liam told me to do it. I hope that it would make him feel safe again. What? I was supposed to take it a step further, but I couldn't do it. I felt so sorry for you. It all makes sense. A lot more sense now. Thank you for telling me. I still don't feel safe with you around. Can you now leave? Yes, of course. I'm sorry again. He knows Liam. Man, this game. This game is twisting me up. What, we stared there all night? What the fuck? Shit. Really? It's night already? Yeah. How long were we looking in that spy hole? This basement needs, needs an answer. We're going down there, I know we are. Go to bed. How can you sleep? Right, both doors are locked, yeah? Yeah, okay. Right, we're going to bed. Shit, what's that noise? Old houses make noises, though. Wait. I didn't close that. For that, please. What the fuck? I'm just coming out the bedroom door. No, don't say that. No. No. I don't have anything. Fuck. Oh, God! helpless now, don't you? Your car doesn't work. Your phone is dead. The police think they got the person behind this and you don't know where I am. There is nothing that can stop me anymore. I, I kind of agree. I know. 
if I follow down the other path I saw when I first got here, maybe I can find some neighbours that can help me. Just run out into the woods. Perfect plan. Right, now just go. Alright, that's the objective, isn't it? the other path? That's it, I'm dead. Oh, Do you hear that? Other path. This is the other path. Oh my god. I can hear someone moving. What is that? Can I take the car? Definitely Liam's car. Yeah, of course it is. Wait. Is he in here? Nah, mate. Nah, mate. The path ends here. He's been camping out down here, isn't he? Is it my grandpa? Fucking run. What the hell? God. That's the door. Okay, I made the jumping. It's the cashier. I told you. I knew Ashley. So it was you who've been sending the letters. I know I look similar to your ex-wife, but that doesn't mean I can replace her. I don't care how you look. It's more than enough. Come here. I waited so long for this. I have to run before it's too late. Run! Run! Ah! Fuck, I'm becoming a lesbian! Police are there, the police are there, the police are there! I can hear the police! I'm not looking behind me! Is that a cop? Did I survive? on the scene just in time, thanks to Grandpa. He hurried back home after the abrupt ending to Kate's phone call with him. When he arrived home, he realised that Kate was nowhere to be seen. He got a sinking feeling that the worst might have happened. He called the police instantly and they made just in time the relief Grandpa felt after the news was like nothing else. What happened to everyone else involved? The man in the white van said, his reason for being outside Kate's home was because he saw a stranger follow her from the store. Of course, the police didn't believe him when they saw no one else was there. But when the news broke free about this, the police realised their mistake, that they had actually been telling the truth. He was released the same day. Liam's accomplice was never seen again after the incident. The psychopath who killed his ex-wife Ashley, Liam, and almost Kate, ended up getting sentenced to life in prison. 
Kate is doing her best to recover from the incident, but it's difficult. At night, she often hears those daunting knocks on her bedroom door, disrupting her attempts to sleep. Throughout every day, she finds herself checking behind and scanning every corner, consumed by fear and paranoia. Fuck. I am so on edge. Bravo. Jesus Christ. That was amazing. That was amazing. Like, it was so intense. And it, I just love games that, like, it, it wasn't the best game graphically. It wasn't the best game. It didn't have any voice acting, and etc. But it, it kept me tense the whole way through. I never knew what was going on or what was outside the house. I love these home invasion horrors. They're very far and few between, but we need more of them. They're so good and effective. Guys, let me know what you think of today's game in the comments. Like, love, caress my channel, and I'll see you in the next one. Stay dazzling.